Welcome to my channel. Today's video is sponsored by Luvari. I hope I am pronouncing it right, y'all. I am collabing with them. They did let me choose a item off of their site. I definitely love to work with them. First of all, let's put that out there right now. Definitely was fast delivery as well. Everything about this company will be in the description box. It'll be everything. I'll also be opening it up. And I'll also be trying on this lingerie piece with y'all as well. It is a robe company that basically works with nightgowns, sleepwear, PJs, you know, that type of sort. Definitely good quality y'all when i say it is good quality it's definitely good quality inside of the packaging it came with a little note the product did come tied up in a little cute bow so that was a plus y'all i will be trying it on and showing y'all but before i try it on i will be showing y'all how it looks laid out i did get it in a size small as well i did get it in a size small and this is what it looks like baby blue definitely giving belly from keisha when i say i posted pictures in this everybody was telling me like you're giving belly from keisha but y'all i definitely love this two-piece definitely loved it i love the color the everything about it now i will be trying it on and showing y'all how it look definitely love it giving the girls exactly what it's supposed to give i believe that this comes in other colors as well y'all so definitely go check them out like y'all i definitely be showing y'all everything as i mentioned this is a two-piece it came with a robe as well and y'all this dress is kind of like a nightgown so on the back you can adjust the straps to your bra sizing as i mentioned you can adjust the straps not only that the robe do come with a little tie so that you can tie it across so that it don't have to be open it's really up to you this is definitely it if you want to look sexy for your do whatever the case is a lingerie party literally like it's giving cute and classy like sis definitely go check them out definitely love work with them everything about this company will be in the description box to be everything let them know that i did send you you can use my discount code to get money off if you are interested in shopping with them y'all literally as i mentioned everything will be in the description box this outfit was a 10 out of 10 for me i definitely will be wearing this robe in this video i will mention saying that i need a new robe so y'all definitely will be seeing me in this blue robe a lot and as you can tell i definitely was loving i definitely was feeling myself i had to take me some pictures but y'all, let's get right into this vlog. I hope y'all enjoy it. As I mentioned, everything about Luvari will be in the description box. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. If you are new, welcome, 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 welcome. I am back with another vlog. And today's video is a weekly vlog, more so. Today is Tuesday. It's the end of March. I'm going to put the exact date below. But I'm going to start off this vlog with basically getting myself together. No wig on, literally nothing. I'm going to brush my teeth and wash my face, get myself together, actually wake up. I'm going to make my bed, fold all my laundry because I did go washing yesterday. And once I'm done folding my clothes, I most likely will vacuum my floors and then make breakfast and then actually start on my hair. So I basically will just be running around like a chicken with my head cut off and y'all basically just be seeing me get myself together basically clean up just vlogging doing shit that i do so i'm gonna put you on fast motion while i brush my teeth and wash my face because i haven't done nothing <laughs> brush my teeth i'm honestly tired of seeing this robe like i'm so over this robe 
but I did get a new one, but I want to save it for my birthday. So, so I'm going to just go ahead and order one off Sheen for like $18, $20, a little cute pink one. Something of that sort, because I'm so over this robe, y'all, literally. Not only that, why the fuck somebody steal my packages off my porch? Not my porch, because first of all, let's get into this. Because everybody likes to comment or respond to stuff. And I know that y'all are my supporters and that's what y'all do. But some of the shit that y'all be saying, it be... Anyways, in my vlogs, I continuously say, I'm finna look at my mail, I'm finna look at my mail, I'm finna look at my mail. I had to go pick up my mail from my mama. I was gonna fuck. That means my mail does not come here. They're making a post saying that my mail ended up getting stolen. And whoever got it, Karma is a bitch. Like, I hope Karma gets you. And everybody, like, get a ring camera, get a ring camera. My mail don't come to my house, so I would have got a ring camera. Not only that, I stay in the apartment building. The mailman is not finna bring my mail to my door. They leave it at the front where the mailbox is at. So even if I did get a ring camera, it would not be no point. Not only that, my key to my mailbox do not work. Or I would have had my mail coming to my house. It does not work, so I have not done it. So I figured, okay, to save me time, the hassle of going to the office, doing all this extra stuff, having them come and fix the mailbox, whatever, just have your stuff shipped to your mama house, right? Because I've been doing it from when I moved out, when I was staying with my ex, whatever. A wig and a pair of dunks ended up getting shipped out, and they both got delivered at the same time. And they left the packages on the porch, they didn't ring the doorbell, they asked for a signature, they didn't put it inside the door like they usually do, they didn't do anything. So when I had mom and them go check, it was nothing out there. That means somebody took it. So now the company looking at me as if I'm responsible for it. At the end of the day, that ain't got shit to do with me because y'all didn't put no signature. I never had no problem at that. Never had a problem with my mail until now. So now it's really like, y'all just gonna have to figure out what the fuck y'all gonna have to figure out. That's what it is. And I'm dinner finna just give me a P.O. box because I'm so over it. Like, I'm so over trying to, is my mail there? Is it my mail there? Is there any mail there? Or can y'all check the mail? Like, I'm so over everything. So I'm finna just give me a P.O. box and just say, fuck it. I really don't want to because I figure, why not go to free route? talk about the um scented tissue in my last vlog a lot of y'all was commenting saying that it could you know throw off your ph don't use it i used it before and i did not have a problem or i would not have bought it again but i definitely should not have told people to go and get it or recommend it because everybody body is different everybody ph is different everybody everything is different okay not only that y'all tissue is used for multiple purposes okay you can clean your face with it you can blow your snot with it you can put it for, use it for makeup Whatever the fuck it is. Tissue is used for multiple purposes, not just for your vagina. But a lot of y'all was commenting. I do understand. I totally understand. I totally understand. Lately, y'all, I've been using this Pons. It is the um, dark spot corrector. The pink one. So I'm just going to put this over my face and rub it in. But before I use that, I'm going to take some tissue. But I'm just going to basically take this witch hazel and rub it all around my face really in the spots that I really wanted to be in type. Now I'm taking this and I'm just gonna basically rub it in. And y'all, this smells so good. I thought the blue one smelled good. This smelled even better, honestly, truthfully. But I don't really know if I even been seeing a difference with my dark spots, cause I really haven't even been paying no attention. But I'm gonna be more consistent with it because I really haven't been that consistent with it. Like, I'm so ready for this to go away up in here. Like, when my cycle come, I always get acne bumps up in here. So, it tends to leave a scar, if y'all can see. One right there and one right there. So, those are my main goals. Honestly. <laughs>
So y'all, I'm about to cook me some breakfast, most likely some eggs, sausage, and a piece of toast just to start the day off because I am hungry as fuck, literally. Once I'm done cooking my breakfast, I'm gonna do my hair, shower, do my makeup, get dressed, and then start my day, like, you know, actually start my day. I wanna go grocery shopping, but I don't wanna go grocery shopping. So I don't wanna go like I don't eat all the food that I already got, and I feel like I keep buying stuff and the stuff that I already got is still just sitting. So I'm just gonna go and buy, you know, milk, eggs, the necessities, the main stuff, cheese, stuff like that. And then I'm gonna go grocery shopping probably next week. And also, as y'all know, in my last vlog, my couch was not even real. It was supposedly a scam. So I'm really skeptical on even ordering another one off Amazon again, but I know the ones in the stores are like seven, eight hundred dollars. You know what I'm saying? For a furniture set. And I know I can get one off Amazon for at least two, three hundred. So I'm currently in the process of really debating if I even want to go through this process of delivery again. And I know I can't go and pick it up because I have a car, you know, a regular small car. Not only that, y'all, I'm not a man. I'm not strong as fuck. I can't pick up furniture, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I figured getting delivered would be the best thing. But honestly, truthfully, I don't know. But I'm so ready to get it done because I'm tired of waking up and walking into my living room and it's nothing there but a fucking rug. So y'all, I'm in the middle of doing my hair. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what's the style that I'm going for, honestly, but once I'm done with my hair, I'm gonna get in the shower. I might get in the shower. I'm damn near finna get in the shower now, but I kinda wanna straighten the hair out first. I kinda wanna do a different style, but I kinda wanna do a straight side part, cause y'all know the straight side parts always give. 
I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna see. So y'all, I just got done doing my hair. And in the process of me doing my hair, I ended up getting an email from YouTube. I'm like, okay, cool. You know, today is payday from YouTube. They're probably emailing me saying that they put out a payment. Y'all, why the fuck they just demonetize my YouTube channel? So I am no longer getting paid for YouTube or posting videos, nothing. When I say I'm so irritated, when it's, it's not one thing, it's another. Literally, like, I just moved into my own shit. I just started getting shit together. I just started, like, bruh. When I say the devil be working, the devil be working. And at this point, I was just like, you know what? Well, fuck this YouTube shit. I'm finna stop doing it. It's time to go get a job. It's time to start doing hair. It's time to do something different with your life. But mama told me, don't let that stop me. There's something better coming. Not only that, y'all, they demonetize my channel for smoking. I know y'all know that there's multiple people on here that smoke other than just me. Y'all even know that there's multiple people on YouTube that smoke than just me. That been smoking before me. So I'm really confused on why the fuck is y'all fucking with me? Why is y'all messing with me? Why is y'all even digging into my shit? Now that I haven't even been doing smoke sessions lately. Because I've been telling y'all I don't want to get demonetized. I made a whole smoking channel before that. So it's really time to step it up. Lock in, tap in. I don't know when y'all will be seeing this video. Y'all probably will be seeing this video next month. Like the beginning of next month. Because I don't want to be not recording. I don't want to get depressed. I don't want to, you know. And I'm like, I'm not trying to be emotional on camera at all. But y'all, I'm so irritated. Not only that, somebody stole my mail. A pair of dunks and a wig yesterday. Like, I just can't win for losing. I'm not going to stress it. I'm not going to get to me. I'm going to run me up a blunt and smoke. I haven't smoked all day and I feel like that's probably one of the reasons why I'm more emotional. I really don't even give a fuck about it because I know that I can make a new channel. Boom. But it's still the principle. Like, bro, I'm starting to feel like I wasted time, energy, all that. Work, editing, all this. Like, what the fuck? So, y'all, I am leaving the liquor store. I just went and got me some Teleport. I don't know why I got it, honestly, but it's a new brand. It's called the Black Teleport or the Teleport Black. And I've been wanting to try it, honestly, so I figured why not try it with y'all. I might just go live on YouTube as well. I cannot let me get demonetized, you know, pull me down or bring me down, get me in a depressed mode, anything of that sort, because I didn't came far enough, okay? And we own the bigger and better, and it's only up from here, simple as that. So with that being said, I'm finna go home. I might go live on YouTube. I'm also gonna cook. I'm gonna show y'all what I cook. I'm thinking about cooking chicken wings. I ain't make no chicken wings in a while. But I'm thinking about making chicken wings. We want barbecue and then hot. Then I'm also thinking about making some, some type of bread. I don't know if I'm gonna do cornbread or croissant bread, one or the other, but like some rice, something of that sort, but not white rice. It's like some chicken rice. So y'all, it is the next day, it is the next morning. I want to come on here because I probably will not be vlogging for the next um, day or two. Or probably just for the day. Um, I just got news that a close friend, family friend, just passed away. Not only that, this is somebody that I grew up with type shit. So I'm really trying to get my mental together and look at, you know, the bigger picture, look at the brighter side of shit. I probably don't even post this vlog because I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm finna roll up and smoke. I feel like I've been so emotional lately. And this is not the time for this. Like, this is not the time for this. You know? So, y'all, it is Thursday night. It's like 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock. I just woke up from a nap. I wanted to give y'all a little quick update. Um, I haven't recorded since like two days ago, for the simple fact. I ended up getting some news. A family friend ended up, you know, passing away. So, I was really emotional. Not only that, I had a funeral to attend today, which was Thursday. So, I was really going through a lot, honestly. This week, these past few weeks, just been a lot. And I will ask for everybody to keep me in a prayer, you know, mentally-wise mentally wise because bruh i'm just tired honestly truthfully my friend birthday was the day before yesterday and she's supposed to be going out tomorrow having a party you know like rent out a little section at a club a known club and then saturday's supposed to be going to chicago so that is the plan i might carry out this vlog or i might just end it the way i'm feeling i might just end it and start a new one because as y'all know youtube and demonetized my channel but i'm currently going on the weed man so that i can smoke and chill, find me something to watch, ease my mind, get my mind off the same thing. Yeah, I'm thinking about DoorDash tomorrow as well, just to make some extra money. I most likely do DoorDash. So I might take y'all with me to DoorDash, you know, show y'all how much money I make and then close out this vlog. That's what I might do. So yeah. So y'all, it is Friday. 
I'm currently cooking me breakfast before I go on DoorDash so I can have something on my stomach, my phone charged up. So I'm gonna stop and get gas before I start DoorDash so that I can actually do it and I have to stop and gas in my car. My wig became off, I didn't have to put it back down, all type of shit. But I'm gonna make me a quick breakfast to get me going and start my day, you know, actually wake me up. I'm smoking my morning blunt currently. I wanted to record a hot box bathroom session yesterday, but I was not feeling up to it. I really slept most of the day once I came back from the funeral. So guys, I did go out last night. I did enjoy myself. My bed sheets are off. Well, hanging off for dear life. So I definitely enjoyed myself. I had fun. I did not record. I don't know why I didn't record. I wanted to record me getting ready. I wanted to record me out and about. But I didn't know where I was going to go. Honestly, truthfully, I had two places to go. As I mentioned, I had two friends whose birthday basically was like a day apart. And they both invited me out. The one that I was going to originally, she wasn't responding back fast enough. Like, okay, I know it's your birthday and shit. But if you're telling people to meet you somewhere or come somewhere, you should at least be able to respond back to them to know if you're there or not. So that was that. I ended up going somewhere else. When I got to where I was going, she started responding back. And it was already too late because I was already somewhere else at the second place. So not only that, it did snow last night. We got like 10 inches of snow, y'all. Not only that much... Not only that, Mother Nature decides to come last night as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and not this vlog, get my life together. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to go follow me on Instagram and on TikTok. We at 50k, we're gonna roll to 100k, you know the vibes. Until next time, I don't know when I'll be vlogging again, honestly, truthfully. But until next time, I will see y'all in my next video. <laughs>